Ebola crisis, Senegal defends Guinea border closure. Senegal has defended the closure of its border with Guinea because of the Ebola outbreak, despite warnings that such measures are counterproductive. The World Health Organization, who says travel bans do not work. Senegal's health minister Dr. Ava Marie Corsac told the BBC the travel ban would not affect humanitarian flights and that the WHO was learning, like everybody else. In Liberia, a boy of 16 shot while protesting about a quarantine has died. Sheikhi Kamara was one of three people seriously injured on Wednesday after security forces fired at protesters, angry after blockades were erected around the West Point slum. The current outbreak of Ebola is the most deadly ever, killing at least 1,350 people so far. In other developments, in Nigeria, the health minister has announced two new cases of Ebola, spouses of people already infected. Five of Nigeria's 14 cases have died, while another five have recovered and been discharged. The British doctor named by the UN to coordinate the global response to the crisis told the AFP news agency the current outbreak was either close to a plateau, but then we'll drop, or we're in a phase, an inflection point, where it is going to increase, and I absolutely cannot tell. A WHO spokesman has told the BBC that a deadly fever which has killed at least 13 people in the Democratic Republic of Congo was not Ebola, saying it was febrile gastroenteritis. An Irishman who died after recently returning from Sierra Leone did not have the Ebola virus, health authorities have confirmed.